welcome to Emily Entertainment. My name is Emily and today we're going to be doing a face mask video. So there's going to be multiple videos on this specific kind of thing. So I have th three face masks so there's probably going to be three videos. So the first one I have is this passion fruit face mask. Next one I have is this pore control face mask. And the one I'm going to be using today is going to be this gold um, face mask, which makes you have glowing skin. So we'll see at the end if I actually do have glowing skin. So I'm going to rate these from 1 to 10. So let's see what the gold one we are trying today gets. Okay guys, so the first step you need to do is put your hair back. So I'm gonna do that. Okay, and my hair is up. So the next thing we need to do is basically just wash my face. So I'm gonna do that now. So I'm just gonna, you know, just grab this and I'm gonna put it under some water. And yeah, no, 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 actually, I don't know. I didn't really need to film this part, but yeah. So I washed my face. Now I'm going to dry my face. Okay guys, so I dried my face. The next thing we need to do is remove the mask from the this. So, you kind of want to be careful because they have these like picture picture instructions here and that's actually really handy for me so I'm just going to like memorize this. I have to wait 10 to 20 minutes for this. So, and it looks really watery, but it looks really cool. Whoa. Okay. Okay, so I got that off. I'm just gonna show you guys when I open that. That actually looks really cool, so I think you can get it on your hands. I've never done one of these before, so if I'm doing it wrong. Um, I hope I'm not doing this wrong. I mean, see what just got on my table. I don't want to break this. This feels like so delicate. Eee. I'm filming all of this since it's like my first ever time putting a face mask on. Are you supposed to take this little thing off? I don't know. It ripped a little bit. It's okay now. I'm going to figure this out and I'll be right back. Hello. Okay, so I put the mask on. Feels really weird. Looks really weird. Feels so like jelly like. I'm gonna move it up a little bit. It's really like. Do I look weird? I think I do. So it says to wait 10 to. Um, you're supposed to wait 10 to 20 minutes, right? Yeah, 10 to 20 minutes. I don't think I'm gonna wait that long because it's. Kind of irritating my skin a little bit. But yeah. So I'll be back in 10 to 20 minutes. Okay guys, so this is what the mask looks like after about 10 minutes. So it's kind of like falling off my face as you can see up here. And then the thing I like about it is it has like mesh over my eyes so it doesn't get in my eyes. Because it's like really sticky and wet. I don't know if you guys have ever done this before, but if you guys have ever done this before, does it feel like this? Well, anyways, I'm going to show you some little, like, little clips of what it looks like before I take it off, so. It has little hexagon things. And yeah, it's covering my mouth, but it's not actually touching my mouth, so. Because one thing I know, it's not supposed to go in your eyes or on your mouth, so it's not actually touching my mouth. But it feels so weird. And I thought it was going to be like a really crispy like feeling, but it's really wet. 
I don't even know how to explain this feeling. So, that's what it looks like. Uh, I think I'm going to take it off. Ready? Three, two, one. Look how wet my face is. You can see those like marks, like of wetness. I don't know if you can reuse them or not. I don't really think you can, but I'm going to see after this video if you can. So I'm just going to get my hands and then I'm going to like thoroughly like wash my face. To get this off and see if I have clear skin. Because that's apparently what this face mask was supposed to do. So I'm just going to quickly go over it without it being wet first. Tutorial with Emily on how to wash your face. <laughs> I'm just washing where it touched. Like where the face mask touched. So I think that's good with just wiping it. Now I'm going to put water on my face. So I don't really need to film that. So I'll be right back when I'm done. Okay guys, so I washed my face. My face feels like really nice right now. How feel? Oh my gosh, my face feels so silky. Okay, so I think that was a good success. Um, I don't really, I don't think I can tell if my face is glowing. Is it glowing more than it was at the start? I don't really know. That's you got your opinion, so. Um, actually, I was going to say post in the comments down below if you can um, see a difference in my face after using the face mask, but I'm pretty sure you're not allowed to comment down below anymore. I don't know. I could be wrong, but if you can comment down below, comment down below that. Okay, so I'm just going to give my opinions off of that and rate it. So, I think I rate that face mask a 9. I'm going to say 9. It was really cool. It, I liked how it has the, have, I like how it was a peel off mask and it had the mesh around the eyes. I don't know if all peel off masks have that, but this one did since it was my first one. I'm basing this one off of like good things. So, I'm giving it a 9 because it has good qualities and it made my face feel so nice. I mean, I think with a little more water, my face could feel like really smooth. It's just because my face is kind of grainy right now because of the, when I was using the rub on my face. But anyways, I rate this a 9. So anyways, as I said again. Thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to leave a like, subscribe, and turn on those post notifications so you never miss another one of these, these videos. This is part one for this. Stay tuned for the next. They're not going to be in this video, but they're going to be in future videos. I have the passion fruit and the pore cleansing one coming up in the next few videos. So... Stay tuned for that. Well, until next time, guys. Bye.